Well, two sides shaking hands before this contest gets under the way. Blackheath and Thornborough up against St. Columbans. Blackheath, Thornborough College from Charters Towers. It's a long way to come there, coached by Toby Painter. And St. Columbans. This is St. Columbans College at Caboolture. It used to be St. Columbans College in Brisbane, but not anymore. St. Columbans College will receive. Bucky Thornborough about to get things underway. Siren goes off. So that'll be a line dropout straight away. No breeze here today. As yesterday was quite strong, so can't we really, really take an advantage of from either side. So Blackie, they'll have the first chance of the try line. Selmas gets some heavy contact there from the defence. Two front rows coming together. Blackheath Thornborough on the attack. Fogarty. Get up and play it. Ooh, I thought it was a hint of a knock on at the back there, but not to be. Going sideways, trying to weave his way through there as Simpson, but he's run around his own player, so that's an obstruction, so... That's a relieving penalty. Let's go, get up. Finds touch, 30 metres out. It's a very skinny 10 metres, but anyway, as long as he's consistent. Still driving with the legs, not called held. Devlin Nell. Couple right hand fence there, but he doesn't get away from Jordan Koo. Four players on this blind side, they go that way. To Party Campbell, gets across the halfway line. Haru. Lachlan Grace, good carry, almost to the 30. 10 in from the broadcast side here at St. Lawrence's playing fields at Runcorn, southeast Queensland. Nice, don't argue, two of them. Finally takes a tackle there to Sebastian Booth. Last tackle. They go to the blind side, keeping it alive through the hands. Kick into the end goal area. He's going to be tidied up the back here and he'll dive into the field to play. So he's still got 90-odd metres to go to get to the other end. So a good end of the set of six there from St. Columbans. Looking to drive the ball carry into the in-goal area. They've gone sideways. Blackie Thornborough, Charters Tower side. Probably travelled the furthest of both sides. Flick pass, keeping it alive, razzle-dazzle. This young fella might have played a little bit of touch footy. Certainly knows how to put a step on. Very elusive. Fortunately for our team list, Mr. 17 doesn't have a name. So we're going to call him... Generally, I'll look for a principal. We're going to call him Kerwin. All the Kerwins I know seem to be able to dodge a lot of things, like work. That's a train hooter, so scrum feet here for St. Columbans. Clap the hands, underball here. Charging on there, there's Sebastian Booth. Looks for a flick pass, gets it away here now to Horo. Horo thinks about getting an offload himself, but he'll take that tackle 12 metres out from the try line. Dummy half is Douglas. Houlihan. Through a dummy, straight towards the line there. Tackle by Kerwin, they'll get up and play it. 
Two out from the try line. Now make that four. Now two falls down, just short of the try line. Grace. Full back in Booth. Booth gets a cutout ball. It's been touched. He's going to rail in. Goes over and scores a try. And Tapati Campbell comes up with a four-pointer. A way to possession. Cephas Creed Haynes is the player I've been tracking down. Ranks number 17. So we'll, we'll take Kerwin out of the team list. Conversion attempt goes to the left. Four nil. Forty minutes to the remaining first half. Well, big carry, good carry from the kickoff. Getting to his feet nice and quickly is Douglas. Well, he's going to be penalised for pushing the the tackler out of the ruck. Fair enough. So Blake Douglas remonstrates, but he's guilty as charged. They've just scored a try. If they leak one here, coach should be very disappointed with that sort of effort. Bruce Moore. He'll get up. It's with Haynes. Now with Selmus. Selmus gets picked off. Throwing the game along to Party Campbell. Bruce Moore. Put it through the hands. Back inside. Oh, I thought he had the length to go. He may have tried to get the footy over the line. He's going to lose it in the tackle. Play on, says the referee. I'm not really sure there was an advantage. There wasn't, so he'll have the scrum 10 metres out. After this one will be Aquinas against Columba. It's due to kick off at 2.30. Oh, breakthrough here. He's got some wheels. Has he got enough to get to the other end of the ground? Ankle tap. <coughs> Hulahan makes a break. Gets an ankle tap from Pearl and Hunter. Penalty, another one. Inside the 10, the scrambling. And Sean Chapman, the referee, will actually... Need to ask him another question. Why can't you take a quick tap anymore? He's got to go back. Let's roll on. They want the game to go faster. I don't know if I'm just here at Confluent in any form of the game. They seem to not allowed to take a quick tap. Haru, actually, I'm going to find out about that. That's my little homework assignment. So we see, oh, good carry. Blackheath Thornborough under the pump defensively again. Big back line to the left. Grace it's tangled up in a in the tackle of two defenders to the right cut out ball subtle gives the offload and he'll go over and score in the corner and Isaac Wells comes up with a two point four pointer I should say <clears throat> it's 
St. Columbans from Kabulcha score their second. They go to the right, cut out ball, just regather and turn and reset. But there wasn't much more territory to be gained by Isaac Wells to score that try. They'll eight nil. He's taking it back to the almost to the thirty. Breeze to start to pick up left to bottom left to top right, Scotty. A little windsock. Northeastly. Okay. Strikes it. This is gonna be waved away. Score remains. Eight nil. I'll call you a weather vane, I think, rather than the other one. Eight nil. Ten minutes, just under ten minutes still to go first half. Not very often the ball's been kicked to that side of the field from the restart, but Toby Parker will get up and play just short of 30. Easy metres at the moment here for St. Columbans. Again, another big body goes into the line. This time's with Atkins. Gets over Take halfway. So that's three tackles. College to thank their gold sponsors for the carnival. Dummy half a row. Brisbane Broncos. It's the 40. Well, they've gone 60 metres, thereabouts. Sports Australia, Landscape Booth. Solutions and Rochelle. Without their Booth help, still going. Now he's to the 30. It's the last tackle. Good set of so 60 from St. Columbans. Ortiz. End over end kick. Bounces or sits up just. Tyrone Simpson will take that. Tackle just short of his own try line. Oh, big defence trying to drive him back in the end goal. Just falls underneath the weight of too many players in the end. Still to get to their 10 metre line. Big contact coming this time from Devlin Leal. Nell. No way through the middle. Knocks it on. Will the referee say back or knock on? Plays. Says knock back. Whipped to the ground. Still haven't made it to their 10 metre line. Now it's their last. 12 metres out from their own try line. What a defensive set here from St. Columbans. What a play up that for a kick though. Sits up. Taken by Toombs. And William Toombs will take that tackle. So not for that raking kick. 40 metres. Maybe in all sorts of try for him. Sebastian Booth gets over halfway. It's a second tackle. McLaughlin goes to run himself. The centre three quarter. And McLaughlin will get up and play on the tackle there of Haynes. Juggle from Houlihan. Still going as Houlihan. Gets the offload away there to Horo. Ortiz, the number seven. He won't be the first number seven to weave his way through to the try line here on field number one. Oh, good grab. Kick into the end goal. Taken on the full in the end goal. That'll be seven tackle restart on the on the 20. See if St. Columbus can replicate their previous set of six defensively. Yeah, 
takes the line, throws a dummy. Noel Fogarty, it's just the halfway line right in front of him. And a penalty taking too long to get off him. That's a startling coloured pair of boots. That's not going to find touch, it is. Ooh, got every inch of field number one. Giant kick there from Noah Fogarty. Eight nil, under five to go. I'd like to put points on the board. He's got half a set play here. That's pretty straightforward. Bruce Moore, the prop. Still standing in front of the left upright. Catch and pass with pace, hitting the ball at pace. And Jordan Koo goes over and puts a try on there for Blackheath Thornborough from Charters Towers. That's how far he ran from. Score that try. Saw him running at pace. Leaves the defence tatters. 8 4, kick to come. We hit strength. Situations the previous game, where conversions let the opposition down and kept the other side in touch with their six points. Version. Successful. Well, they had a bit of a look. Must have just snuck inside the right hand upright. So that's the left upright, as I said. Catch and pass, and then bang. Q on Q. Scores to try. Stepped. Probably would have caused more damage if he had it kept going. Two and a half remaining. Simpson. We go to the far side. The old change room sides here at Runcorn. Takes the tackle running around his own player. That's how it's done. We've seen about seven or eight tack, uh, penalties for uh, obstruction. That's the first time we've seen somebody actually take the knee to stop. That's the charge down. That should be six more to go, and it is. Bruce Moore. Blind side, loses it, goes without it, has to be dived on in the back play. He's going to call that for a knock on. The 90 seconds to finish his first half. Two tries to one in favour of St. Columbans. Converted try to Blackie from Thorn Thornburg. Ortiz still going, gets the offload now to McLaughlin. Ten minutes out now, McLaughlin. Dummy half Horo. They go to the blind side. To Tali Campbell, thinks about the offload. Hangs on to it, a metre short. Cut out ball. Lions 
Lyons for the try line, and Lyons is going to reach out and be short, is he? Well, he might have promoted it over the line. Market defence comes out pretty quickly and shuts down Horo. Stepping back off the right, going back into the field of play now is Houlihan. Last tackle now for St. Columbans. Well, that's been touched backwards, though. Play on. Referee's going to say it's a forward pass, but if anything, if that's the case, it should actually be a... There's a knock on. Oh, OK. And that will be half-time. Eight points to six. In favour of St. Columbans. Half-time. Let's check the replays out here for... CQ University, just through the hands. Ducks under one. Lucky to hang on it. Goes over and scores a try to, to Party Campbell. And the second one, another cutout ball. And easy as you like for a try in the corner to Isaac Wells and then Blackie Thornburg. Heading with pace to Jordan Koo to score the try. And that will give us our halftime score of eight points to six. Back with the second half shortly. We see you working hard, juggling, dreaming, climbing. We see your ambition, your dedication. We see you gaining confidence in our spaces and on our screens. Yeah, we see you. Doing more and going further. With CQ University Australia, it's... This is a city where the sun shines all year, where we sing when we're winning, and we play without fear. This city is a family, and families stick together. We've always been in it to win it. This city never says never. Waiting for the uh, ground siren. There we are. There we are. Underway the second half. Eight points to six. Two tries to one. St. Columbus lead. Carry. Wait for Thornborough. Had a breather, reset, ready to rumble. Smith. Well, they went from one side to the other, and to be perfectly honest, I don't think they gained any ground there. 
penalty for strip. Finds touch. back almost to where he got the footy from it's a 40 meter line cluttered move there but Bruce Moore ends up with a footy still going as Bruce Moore gets to the 30 Haynes Curtis Curtis pulled down now with Creed Hayes. Nona. It's an anonymous name in North Queensland Rugby League. Nona. Lucky Thornborough from Charterstown. Probably a relative somewhere along the line. Certainly looks like he's got the skills of a Nona. Whoa, put on his back. Knocked the wind out of the lungs. Curtis puts a cross field kick. Take. Oh, loses the footy. That's a try. Not gone both ways. Oh, I'm not sure about that. Let's scrum feet here to St. Columbans. McLaughlin, been strong, the four, still going to McLaughlin. Haynes has to come and pull him down. That's the 30. Center of the park is. McLaughlin Grace, very strong McLaughlin Grace. 13. Hits that with pace there. There's to Party Campbell. To Party Campbell. Pull down from behind. And great defence there from Nona. Throws a dummy. There's a halfback in Ortiz. Reaches out for that catch there as Houlihan. And Blackheath and Thorne will come away with the footy. They're 99 metres from the other end. Down eight points to six. Plenty of time to go. McLaughlin involved in the tackle and a good one. Haynes. Bruce Moore. Ten middle lines. Still has been crossed. St. Columbus defensive sets have been a feature. Gets the offload. That's the try line right behind him. McLaughlin involved in the tackle again. Penalty, a relieving one, late in the tackle count. Crush a tackle. Fine touch. Only just 15 metres out from the trial line, so let's see if St. Columbus can come up with another defensive set of six like the previous one before the penalty for a crush attack big shoulder coming in from Alban Lyons number 19 Haynes a dummy half big shot coming in there onto a party Campbell great attack so it was effective in defence Kick over the top. One of those plays is offside. Not him. Hunter. Call back for a forward pass. Can you believe it? 
He's on his way to the chalk, was Phil and Hunter. And now penalty, I think, for a bit of chat. It's about, it should be six to go here. I thought it was a knock on. There's, oh, forward about a week. A week. No, it's a scrum. I thought it might have been a straight arm penalty for something. But anyway, St. Columbus will come away with the footy. To the tackle. There he goes again. Off and Grace. Now by Creed Haynes. Aitkins. Rolls to the ground there by Selmus. Oh, a little knock on. Set at 2.30. Columba will take on Aquinas. Play quarterfinal. That's a penalty, I think, for an instruction. Hit a player in backfield. No Fogarty's been taken out. Shoulder, bit of an injury there, maybe. Hip, anyway, they take the penalty. <laughs> Fogarty seems to have recovered. Big carry back. Crossfield goes. Creed Haynes. Yeah, you go crossfield, you're going to get hit. Loses the footy as well. Two big players putting a shot on. Want to be careful, it's not a penalty. You can question the referee with a level of respect. The referee's going to award the scrum here now to St. Columbans. Pushes off one to Sebastian Booth. Sebastian Booth got some legs, got some wheels, got some fend. Reaches out and scores a try. That's a great individual try there. Sebastian Booth. Runs about 40 metres. Dances down the sideline and scores. There you go. Watch the halfway line. Throws off one, throws off two. Ku tries to come back at him, but he's just got too much pace. And over he goes. Conversation happening here, but you can't see on screen between the Jackson Curtis and the referee. And he's going back on Johnny's teammates in the end goal area. Not really sure what the talk was, but Takai subtle with his sideline conversion. Short. 12 6. Three tries to, to one. None of them converted. Pushes off 
Jordan Koo. Koo comes back at him along with the fullback there and Tyrone Simpson, but too much momentum gets across the line. St. <laughs> Columbus sent three tries to one, 12 6, converted try here by Blackie Thornburg. Will lock it up. I need to put the man down first. Subtle gets to the 30. Shouldn't have got that far. Cut out ball. Here he goes again. This is Tatali Campbell. Ooh. Almost loses it. Gets the offload now here to Atkins. 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 10 metres short. Reined in there by Fogarty. Penalty. Not sure what for. Wait for the signal. Still no idea. You can't have a shot at goal. Lead 12 points to 6, so that'll take it out past a converted try. Penalty attempt. Successful. 14 points to 6. So six and a half minutes still remaining. Keith Thorne beneath the ball and a try. And a converted one at that. St. Columbus score again. St. Columbus from Kabulcha. Been a feature. These busts up the middle from the big forwards, big mobile forwards. Toby Parker over halfway. Bordeaux. Bordeaux loses the footy. Two knock-ons, the first one from the number nine from St. Columbans. Hunter. He just scored in this set of six. Penalty. Frenchman in the ruck here, pushing sideways. Breaking kick. Takes it to the 40. Under five to go. Here's a chance here for Blackie Thornbra. Jordan Coos, the man for me. Get it to him. Creed Hines. Held says the referee. Curtis. Puts a banana kick over the top. Needs a good bounce. It's going to be retrieved there by the opposite seven and Ortiz. He'll take the tackle and maybe out for his own trial. I'm a bit premature that kick, but pays off it. They're a genius. Hey, Noah. Hey, Noah. 
Ducks under a high ish shot there. There's McLaughlin. One great pass. Tidied up in the end. Good carry there from Heath Harms. Kicking early as well. No winger back. The fullback Simpson has to go back and tidy up. Big defence there. Waiting for a dummy half to turn up. Now there's one. There's only two players back on side for Blackheath Thornborough. Now a full complement. Q. Oh no. Hines. Pass there to Fogarty and Fogarty comes off with an error. Kobe. Kobe. Tyrone. Kobe. Tyrone. Shadow starting to come across field number one. Temperature will start to drop soon. Bit of a delay to feed the scrum, but finally gets underway here with Houlihan. And a terrible pass. Ortiz couldn't pick that one up. Last chance you would think kicking on the first. Regathers, gives the offload, loses his footing. Nona, get up and play it. Lucky to have the footy back. Fogarty, cut down there by Harms. High shot, knock on. think is all she wrote minute and a half to go 14 points to six St. Columbus from Kibbutz will take this win a minute ago St. Columbus with a full set pretty close There is subtle. <laughs> Sebastian Booth, try scorer. Hells is the referee just short of halfway. Oh, fours combining on the charge there as Anderson. He gives off the halfback and Ortiz, and Ortiz will go all the way to the try line and Ortiz. Score a try right on full time. St. Columbans with a kick to come lead 18 points to six. That's the halfway line. Hits it with pace there. There's Anderson. Finds Ortiz and Ortiz. Nona couldn't pull him down. He goes over and scores. Version to come right in front.
Caboose is successful from the front rower. Full time, 20 points to six. And a good win by St. Columbans over Blackheath Thornborough. We'll wrap it up. Next game get underway shortly. Back soon.